We hope that Sri Lanka will, offer, will accept your offer of assistance made during last week's special session and also cooperate more closely with the special rapporteurs. The special session rightly brought attention to the significant loss of life and prolonged suffering of displaced civilians. We support your call for an independent international inquiry to ensure accountability for any human rights and IHL violations committed by all sides. And included in our further activities. Finally, another important point, we must work more than ever in investigating questions of impunity. This means that we need commissions of inquiry that are impartial and independent, looking at violations of alleged violations of human rights uh, by the uh, th throughout the world, whether in Gaza or in Sri, Lan Sri Lanka. This also means supporting the International Criminal Court, and we will. Th there's no peace without justice. We share this conviction with you, and we will work with you to that. Mr. End. President, uh, Sri Lanka noted with uh, some degree of uh, amusement that uh, the EU, the United Kingdom, Ireland and France uh, were all uh, cheering on the notion of uh, an international inquiry into allegations of human rights violations conducted by all sides, as they put it, to the Sri Lankan conflict. So here's the deal. Uh, Sri Lanka will be uh, prepared, I think, to regard this uh, a little more charitably if we start uh, from the from uh, human rights situations that uh, precede the Sri Lankan conflict. Let France institute an impartial independent inquiry into the millions of deaths in so-called French Indochina and then in Algeria, including those who were submitted to electroshock during the Battle of Algiers. Let it also have an independent inquiry into the disappearance of Mehdi Ben Barka from the streets of Paris and possible complicity uh, within, of uh, all sorts of uh, personalities uh, in that disappearance. Let Great Britain and Ireland have an international inquiry into the events of uh, Bloody Sunday 1972 in Londonderry, where there was no fog of war, unlike in the closing stages of the Sri Lankan conflict, but uh, dead civilians were strewn on the streets of Londonderry, and after two commissions of inquiry, uh, the only result has been the promotion of every single soldier who was there on that day, and uh, the uh, commanding officer being uh, given uh, some sort of uh, honors by Her Majesty the Queen. Now, if these countries set an example to Sri Lanka and submit their own conduct to uh, so-called impartial or independent international inquiries of the sort that they have commended us, Sri Lanka would be ready to regard uh, their suggestion with uh, somewhat less contempt than it does at the moment. Thank you.